CrowdMark has been a great solution that Brock, once we lost access to our physical drop boxes and we couldn't take in paper the way we used to at the start of the pandemic, now we're so uh, fortunate to have a paper solution in CrowdMark. And as we got to learn that better, we realized that there's a challenge that you're kind of having to make an either or decision. Do I want this paper-based assessment and question types? Or do I want to collect some uh, multiple choice or attach files? So could you uh, re-explain for my benefit how the new question types in CrowdMark make you have both options? Absolutely. Um, and thank you for that question. So um, as you mentioned, uh, with the pandemic, what people were turning to from our um, remote assessments. So previous to the pandemic, um, pretty much all of our users, it was like 90% in-class, in-person administered assessments, and then um, the occasional remote online, like homework assignment or a simple assignment. Um, once the pandemic happened and everyone shifted to this remote online environment, uh, people started using our remote assessment workflow for everything. And what that um, forced us to do, and like, and uh, you know, pleasantly so, was mm -hmm. to innovate so that we were no longer, this wasn't no any longer an addition to our physical workflow. It was its own um, fully robust solution for remote assessment. And one of some of the feedback that we heard the most when people were uh, assessing remotely using our um, traditional platform was they missed uh, the ability to give students multiple choice questions and have them just be able to select an answer or that that students having to write something out on a piece of paper and take a photo was too time consuming and they wanted students to be able to um, type directly in CrowdMark. Mm. So uh, we made those our focus. We um, are really happy to have been able to push this out. And what it's allowed us to do is, again, continue to building, continue to build this out as a, a fully robust solution, as opposed to just an add-on. So um, you're able to use that remote assessment in the same way that you would a paper assessment, uh, and also as more. Um, than you would as a paper assessment, uh, especially with the text entries ability to attach files, you know, mm -hmm. attach video files, attach um, spreadsheets, attach like presentation data, anything that students are submitting can all be sent in one place um, instead of having it attached and like to an email and distributed across mm -hmm. everywhere. So uh, that's that is the summary of how and why um, we we innovated these new features and hopefully everyone finds them useful and uh, we really value feedback on what you are liking and not liking about new features. So please don't hesitate to reach out with that as well. Will do. Thank you so much for the session. Um, you are welcome. We'll be in touch. I will send you a follow-up and thanks again. We'll talk soon. All right. Cheers. Bye, Matt.